Ladies, we're about to stop buying into the bullshit that they selling you. Stop it, you know? Okay. Okay. Um, first of all, I'm just so sick and tired of everybody talking about the damn swine flu. Yes. The media is really overdoing this whole swine flu thing. Here's my take on the swine flu. Now, I don't think we, the public, is asking the right questions here. How the hell does a human catch a disease from a pig? Can we mate with pigs? In order to get this sick, you would have to be in close proximity with a pig. I mean like all up in a pig's face because this thing is a respiratory disease and it comes and it's airborne. So if you were that drunk or whatever you were doing with a pig, common black sense would tell me that if you did catch something, you probably deserve that. But for the rest of the general population, I think that this is a hoax. I think it's a deliberate act of propaganda. It's designed to create fear and chaos. And did I say fear and chaos? And I think that what this probably really is, is regular good old fashioned flu that many people catch this time of season. So for the CDC, this is, this is my big fat question for you. How, how does that happen? Explain to me specifically how one species can catch something from an entirely different species and here again, if we can catch this from pigs, which freaking pig, why don't you have the pig that gave it to us in the news? You sure gonna show us Rob Lagoyevich all the time. Find the pig that did it. Put his little pig mugshot up on the, in the camera or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Point him out. Is he being quarantined? Because you keep shutting down schools and, and everything else. So to me, you got to do this. But, you know, just in case, I am going to get me a mask tomorrow. I might not.